What's going on, comrades? My name's Crazy Wyatt, and welcome back to some Advanced Wars Days of Ruin. Alright, let's get on to moving on, shall we? Moving on! This dark, treacherous road called life. <sighs> Listen up, roaches. We're low on supply, so it's time to swarm a village. I, I, I don't know if that was his voice since last time. Take what you want. Steal what you want. Kill who you want. There are no prisoners. No mercy. Gwar har har har. <laughs> oh yeah, now I gotta do that. Sir, the mayor was right. Those raiders are camped at an old army base. That's probably where they scavenged their weapons and vehicles. They lack the discipline of a competent army unit, but that's not the fighting skill. Agreed. And we know there are former soldiers and mercenaries among their number. They may have... Wait, they may have been fellow soldiers once, but they're just a pack of dogs now. Let's put them down before they do any more harm to the survivors. Good idea. Captain Brenner! All units have been deployed, sir. Good. Still no sign of the enemy? No, sir. But this dust prevents us from seeing much of anything. Of course, it keeps us hidden, too, so I guess it's not all bad. My training was in reconnaissance and intelligence. Leave this to me. All units, move out! <laughs> Scout unit Bravo reporting. Visibility is poor, and we've lost visual contact with the enemy. I can hear something out there. I think they know we're here, sir. Understood. Bravo. Get get somewhere safe. We're on our way. Watch the word. Watch the woods, sir. I think the raiders are hiding there. All right, let's do this. Let's go to. Let's go to some tactics first, like we always do. Lynn? Uh, I mean, sir? Hello? Lynn? Is that you? Gwahahar! Guess again, loser! Yeep! Wait, what are you doing here? Giving tactical advice! What does it look like I'm doing? You're giving me... Wait, is this a trick? Where's Lynn? Gwahahar! <laughs> so you want your mommy, huh? Well, tough beans. This is beast country, and no one knows it better than me, so listen up. If there's one thing I love, it's ambushing little chumps like you. So don't move without thinking. Use your flares to see what's up ahead. And get foot soldiers into the mountains to give yourself a better view. Now do as I say. Gwar har har, I'm the beast, and I love me so a good tactic session. Later, little man. Okay, <laughs> that was kind of weird. <laughs> he just jumps in and out like that. All right, I can't remember if I if I should use the. Uh... You know, what? I don't know. I forgot what I'd used in the last episode. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to keep it, trying to keep it a. Uh... Cool, get those foot soldiers into the mountains now. <laughs> into the mountains? Why? Did they stop teaching basic recon tactics at the academy? Infantry and mech units can see farther when stationed on mountains. Oh, mountains add three to vision of infantry and mech units. Very useful. Close it. There we go. Yeah, get them in the mountains. Yeah, look at that. Upgrade. Oh, hey, there's a little guy right there. Take him out. Oh, kaboom! No! <laughs> well, you know what? I think the recon, yeah, he he deserves to level up. Get in there! Yes! Unit hit. Standing by. Alright, it's up to you, motorcycle. The flare unit is ready to fire. Oh, we studied this at the academy. Flares can help reveal enemy positions in poor visibility conditions. Smart kid. Maybe you'll be some help to us after all. Aim the flare anywhere you think the raiders may be hiding. 
This unit could be the key to our victory today. Flares are designed for fog of war conditions. Their rockets clear the fog and help your forces see. Wait, hang on. No, I want to shoot. Gotta shoot right there. Bang. <laughs> Uh-oh. Two more units have been revealed. Alright, let's see. Tank, get in there. Take out that mech unit. F them up. Ouch, we lost a tank. That's not good for anyone. Help him out, little guy. Bravo. Bravo team. Hey, it said 39%. Why did it go all the way to 50? You know, I, I ain't complaining. No one attacks the beast in his own home. No one. I mean, you kind of gave us tactical advice. Thanks again for that, but we're going to take you down now. <laughs> Swarm roaches, show no mercy. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Scout unit Bravo has been hit. I'm trying to raise them on the radio. Bravo, do you read? Over. Scout unit Bravo reporting. We're taking heavy fire. We can't continue the mission. We have to retreat. Understood. Double time it back to the base, soldier. Roger that, sir. They're kind of dead. I don't know if they can. Pay attention, Will. Remember that soldiers are a precious resource. We know there's a risk in war, and some casualties are inevitable. But it's our duty to get as many of them home as possible. Avenge our comrades! Ah, taste tank, you biznatch! Go, 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 go. No! <laughs> we need that mech in the mountains ASAP. And we need this mech. Uh, go to this mountain. Can I... Oh, yeah. Hang on, flares can attack these guys. But I want to blow him up first. Oh, yeah, that's, that's good. Kaboom! Kaboom! <laughs> I mean, bang, and then kaboom. I want to kill somebody... With the flare, at least. Let's do that. Come on now. Come on now. Get in that mountain. Alright, that's it. It's, you're up, Mr. Flare. Kick butt out there. They got machine guns. They can still be powerful. Alright, let's see here. Whoop. Oh, he's right there. He's a hiding. He's a hiding from us. Dude, we're still at 7 HP. I think we can do this. Don't you go out. You went after my motorcycle. You didn't even let me finish. That's it. You're dead. Finish him. Ba -ba boom Unit hit. Yeah! They defeated me. This ain't happening. The world is over. Why do these do-gooders care what we do? I'm the beast. No one says no to me. Not even a bunch of soldier boys. I'll be back, losers. And I'm gonna kill every last one of ya. Win. <laughs> Congratulations, you have secured victory yet again, Crazy Wyatt. What do you have to say for this? Oh, you know, it's all about... Uh, I never miss a thing, that's what I say. <laughs> Units left. Spent. Lost value. Uh, oh, oh. We only lost one. Better than all of them. You did it! You drove off those savages. I don't think they'll bother you again. Thank you, Captain Brenner. I think my village can sleep soundly tonight. I'm glad. Now let's talk about your side of the bargain. We drove them off. Now you need to provide Will and the other civilians with shelter. I didn't agree to that. What are you doing? We saved your village. You promised to take in the civilians. I said nothing of the sort, Captain. All I said was that if you scared off those savages, then I would consider it. Isn't that right, people? That's what I said. Your mayor is a man of his word. 
Yeah, that's right. That's what he said. I don't believe this. <laughs> Captain, please control yourself. Even you can see that this bargain of yours affects my entire village. I may be the mayor, but I do not rule by fiat. We are civilized men, after all. We will come to a decision in due course. Until then, you must be patient. Why, you double-crossing... You have only yourself to blame for your anger, Captain. If you misunderstood my words, then the fault is yours alone. I have done nothing wrong. I see. Will you threaten us now? Will you let your guns take the place of your honor? Perhaps we should have taken our chances with the savages. No, Mayor. I won't threaten you. I won't do anything to unnerve these people that you pretend to care for. But what? How dare you? I remember you. I remember how you were, scared, alone, on the verge of death. Do you remember your words to me when my men gave you food and shelter? I will save others as you have saved me, Brenner. That's right. I will construct a village where I can live in peace and rebuild their lives. Do you remember that, or did I misunderstand your words again? Who are you to say such? You're a killer! A soldier, a relic of the past. I give these people peace. I give them hope. You give nothing but horror and death. Captain Branner. Well? Sir, I know you have our best interest at heart, but it's okay. Look, I know it might be safer here in this village, but I don't want to stay. I want to serve with you, Captain. You and the battalion. Out of the question, Will. It's too dangerous. People who truck with us don't live very long. You're young. Your life is ahead of you. Please, Captain. Please, let me stay. Let me fight with you. Honestly, I don't seem to have much choice, I, and I admire your courage. All right, Lynn. Will, prepare to move out. Good luck, Mayor. I think you'll need it. Oh! The 12th Battalion Base Camp. Hey, how's she doing? Oh, Will, thanks for coming again today. She's going to be very pleased. <laughs> I hope so. Sometimes I I just don't know if she even gets it, you know? She looks forward to your visits, Will. When you're here, she is bright and cheerful. Otherwise, she seems a bit sad. Really? Really. But don't worry about it. We'll take care of her. She's She's going to be okay. Um, hi. How's it going today? I I brought you something. I hope you like it. A flower? Yeah, well, it's not a real flower. It's plastic. You can't find many real flowers anymore. I found it while I was on a recon mission a few miles over. It's it's beautiful. What do you call it? Huh? Oh, I don't know. I'm not much of a flower scientist guy. Let me ask Lynn. No, wait. I remember. This is a Catalea Isabella. It's a natural hybrid of the orchid orchid family. Catalea, yes. That's it. That will be my name. I will be named after this beautiful flower you brought me. My name is Catalea. Uh, Catalea? Wow, that's... That's, uh... It's kind of hard to say, actually. How about we call you Isabella? That's really pretty. It fits you better. Isabella, oh, I love it, Will. I made her sound like an old lady. What the heck? I'm so happy. <laughs> yeah? Oh, good. I think it suits you. Thank you, Will. Boy meets girl. Boy gives girl flower. Boy names girl. What's wrong with this world? <laughs> Lieutenant. Um, what are you doing here? I've been here the whole time. Just keeping an eye on you. <laughs> <laughs> ah, dang it. Lynn is such a troll. I love her. But that that uh, brings the close to chapter four, comrade. So thank you so much for watching. Stay crazy, and I salute you. My name's Crazy Wyatt signing out. Peace, comrades.